One thing I did not realize is that this charging port is really not needed if you have the Smart Home Panel 2 because it's really going to charge it as it needs from this plug from the Smart Home Panel 2 that goes to the batteries or whatever, so, or to the inverter, I guess, and then the batteries. Um, so you really don't need to use this unless you want to manually do it, but if you have this plug plugged into your inverter, then it's going to charge the unit basically bypassing this AC. Um, I was under the impression that I had to charge it that way, but I guess that was dumb considering the panel is supposed to be smart. Um, but now I know.